es que en alguien yo confíe Con una euforia cupido se la vacíe No me vuelvo a enamorar, no Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So I'm rushing a little bit, so I'm about to give y'all a quick rundown of what's about to go down. Right now, currently, I'm about to go get me a curly cut all the way in Charlotte, cause I couldn't find nobody nearby. But do y'all see how long the hair is? Um, They say come washed and with no products in, so that's why it looks like this. So, I don't know if the black on black is the best idea, but like I told you, I'm brushing, so I just throw on this Lulu set on. So yeah, y'all, my hair has just got super long, and Tammy usually like trim it whenever she do my hair or stuff, but this time, I want a few inches off, so I don't know yet. We're gonna see what they recommend, because first, it's gonna be like a consultation, but I do want to go shorter just so the curls can look curlier, because once my hair gets longer, of course, my curls look a little more stretched out. But, yep, that's what we're about to get into right now. Like I told y'all, I'm rushing, so about to head out. Y'all know it's an hour and 30 drive. Once we get back, I'll let y'all know what else we'll be getting to in this video. But for right now, curly cuts. I'm excited, y'all see. Before, give y'all one more time. My hair has got super long and it's needed. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, all of that. And let's go ahead and hit the road. I'm excited. Curly cuts. What is given? It looks so freaking curly. Yeah, all the way from the top, all the way. This is how short we went, y'all. My hair grow fast, so I wanted to go short, shorter than my usual. This is the final product, 
but it was super cute in there um customer service 10 like you know the girl that worked on my hair was real sweet and just checking on me the whole time and giving me what i wanted real curly hair look good so it feels so soft it looks shinier i don't know she recommended me some products so that's what i got in here i think she said the hydrating what is it shampoo and then a mask so basically i got it cut we did like a steam treatment and then like diffused it so yeah my appointment was like an hour and 30 it wasn't long it was pretty quick so i'm satisfied with my hair it looks really really good so we're actually about to go somewhere try to grab like lunch it's 12 30 so i ain't nothing i'm hungry so just wanted to show y'all the hair right after the appointment so y'all can see what it's giving you like I think it looks great. He said he never seen my hair this curly. Yeah, and it looked like shiny and like black. All right, y'all. So once we figure out where we're gonna grab food from, I will check it with y'all. But hair, I give you the team. I love it. All right, y'all. We're going to Easy Like Sunday. It's pretty out here. Easy Like Sunday. It's the vibes in here. It's cute. The little greenery the lights and it ain't too busy it's still brunch time so breakfast i want that the mimosa you gonna drink with me i don't know what i want the curves can't tell me I get French toast. Thank you. All right, y'all. We got the mimosa sampler. It's passion fruit, peach, lavender, and Hawaiian. And then you get a damn bottle. All right, y'all. I got French toast. Added strawberries. Chicken sausage. I got pancakes with chicken, fried chicken. Oh, look good. Taking huh. Cheers. What was this one? The peach one? Better than the chicken ones. I mean, the turkey ones. They do. Where? Uh, I want some of your chicken. Girl, you gonna back up off my chicken? That's for you. Stingy. Yeah. Yeah, wait now. <laughs> Literally, really With good. With the hot sauce. Yeah. Well, everything good. I don't like a lot of juice. <laughs> no, a little more. We're on our second one. Thank you. Cheers to our second one. Second flavor. I kind of forgot the name she said. That tastes like spa. What? <laughs> when I go to the spa, I get lavender. That's what it is, right? Lavender? 
I never had lavender. It tastes like spa. I don't know if I like it. I'm still drinking though. All right, we have the beautiful banana. About to pour these next these next drinks for us. At this point, I think she's feeling it. Keep forgetting. <laughs> if you tilt the, the glass while you're pouring it, I think that like uh, do something with the bubbles. Or no. <laughs> Yeah, that's more like it. Yeah, it tastes like lavender. She's talking about the last drink tastes like spa. <laughs> like what? Our last mimosa. We are done. Deuces. Los que antes no volteaban hoy me tratan de señores Por los exclusivos de calzones que me sirven de acción I don't speak portugués I can't speak inglés Dale mamá con tu taca ta taca ta taca ta Straight wait, I'm the rookie, but my features in my shows 10 times your pay 50k for a verse, no album out. Yeah, my money's so tall that my barbie's gotta climb it. Hey, you all. So, um, at Publix, we already back in Winston. My camera went dead, so I'm on my phone, but yeah, we back in Winston. We was gonna stay in Charlotte, we wanted to do like a little date making candles because I've been to it before, but Zay never went to it, so he said he was down to do it. But they didn't have nothing available to five and it was only two o'clock so i didn't want to wait three hours so yeah we was like let's just head home but i'm at publix currently because i'm doing like a juice detox so i have to get the fruits tammy has a juicer so she said she was down to make the juices for me the detox is only for three days so it's 12 juices that she has to make for me so I'm basically at Publix to get all the stuff I need. I don't know when I'm gonna start the diet. I don't, not today. Yep, we back in Winston. We was lit in the car, but we in Publix. I had to use the bathroom real quick. So yep, let's go grab everything I need. I just wanted to update y'all and let y'all know what was going on. All right, y'all, change of plans. I'm gonna actually get the fruit probably Sunday and do the detox starting Monday. So yeah, so it could be fresh. Um, it's currently Wednesday. I didn't have no plans of like doing that in the upcoming days, but 
Karen just said we got we're gonna do a studio session Friday so it might be some drinking involved and I feel like on the weekends it's about like you know going out eating out so I don't think I should start it on the weekend I think I should start fresh either Sunday or Monday so I'm gonna just wait but I am about to grab some damn poppies the little prebiotic sodas because we out and I want some and then we need to go home and check on our babies Barbie and Benji just updating y'all on the change of plans so probably when we get home I'll check in with y'all because we got an unboxing I'm excited about hey y'all so i'm home i'm actually about to show y'all my late little valentine's gift guess what this man got me y'all you're supposed to say daddy am i here baby <laughs> what oh <laughs> uh, like what's her name mariah, mariah. hermes so we about to unbox it. He just got home last night. He got these in Detroit because they got a store out there in Detroit. So yeah, I haven't opened it. I really wanted to last night, but I'm like, I want to open it with y'all. So we about to unbox them. It's some Hermes slides. And yeah, we about to unbox them together. All right. If my nails was, well, we missing two nails. I'm not getting my nails done close to Nicki. Oh baby, it's March. We going to see Nicki Minaj March 26th. It's March, it's Nikki month. So, I hope y'all ready for that, cause I am. But yeah, I'm not getting my nails done till March 23rd, cause we already, well, March 13th today, so it's kinda pointless. I think I'm gonna get short nails in today, cause I, this, I don't like the look of this. Drum room. <laughs> oh my God. She pretty. All right, y'all. So, I'm excited because I've been wanting some of these forever. Um, yeah, I've been wanting these for a minute. I feel like these going to be so good for vacation. I want all the colors. I got to show y'all the details. <laughs> so, they each, each pair come in like a different little bag. Got their little logo. I went with the pink ones. Oh my god. So I was gonna do red. I know my favorite color, but they ain't have red. So I'm like, let me just do pink because I'm always doing red anyways. Like switch it up, no no. But I for sure want like white, black, um, brown, you know the basic colors for vacation. I went with a size 36. They literally fit freaking perfect. Let me give y'all a better look. Well, let me take this one out. I went with a 36. I'm usually like a 35, 35 and a half. And sometimes I do like a 36 if they don't have like 35 or you know. So I'm like, let me do 36 so they can last longer. They fit perfect, they gon'. Yeah, I'm glad I did 36. Let me show y'all a better look. All right, y'all, so a better look. You know, like my toes don't be looking too hard, but they fit good. I love this pink color, hot pink. So cute. So yeah, they fit. Let me stand up. All right then, Donna. I'm tired, y'all. I woke up at eight in the morning for my hair appointment. It was at 11, so I had to wake up at eight because I wanted to put a little makeup on, you know, get a little cute for my hair appointment. It felt good outside. I wanted to take the dogs on a walk, but y'all know Benji is a French bulldog, so they don't do good with the heat. Like it's easy for them to overheat. So I don't know, we'll wait for the um, sun to go down a little bit. You know, like a little sunset or whatever to walk them. Yep, just wanted to show y'all my Valentine's give. So I'll see y'all in my nails. Hey y'all, let's make a lick mat for Benji and Barbie. They have a lot of good benefits like mental stimulation can be used for stressful activities like grooming, bath time, and will also tire them out. So I'll be using blueberries, unsweetened applesauce, and plain yogurt. You want to get the stuff that doesn't have all that extra stuff added. Oh, and I'm extra, so training treats. These is freeze-dried beef treats. So I like to like sprinkle those on there just to give them like the little meat taste. 
to it so let's get started so you pretty much just want to spread your ingredients on there i'll be starting off with the yogurt because that'll be my main ingredients and then everything else i showed y'all will be basically just like the little toppings to it i got these lick mats off amazon they didn't have like blue or black for benji so i had to go with green but that's the colors we usually like to get him is like blue or black and of course y'all know barbie is always going to get pink and there's also a lot of other stuff you can use for lick mats like peanut butter pumpkin baby food banana like the list literally goes on so pretty much just spreading everything on there i like to make mine nice and neat so my base is basically the yogurt and applesauce so then i'm adding the blueberries what i like to do is smash them up with a fork so it can make it easier for them to lick so these treats i like to just crumble them also to make it easier so pretty simple pretty quick i'm all done and what i like to do is put it in the freezer so if you want to you can give it to them just like that but freezing it will be much better because they'll basically be looking for 20 to 30 minutes and it will tire them out so i recommend freezing it so the lick mats are for after their walk they're going to be tired so then the lick mats is just going to tire them out even more that pretty much concludes their lick mat bye all right y'all so we're about to go on our little walk it's 30 minutes till the sun go down i think seven you know the time change so the sun go down a little later now so yep y'all see me make them lick mats they just gonna get those when we get back so you know cool them down and also tired them out so they put in their harness and leash and all of that and like i told y'all it felt good so i did throw a little skims tank and shorts because yep it feel good i probably just throw my gym shoes on because i always keep them by the door let's take these dogs to walk because it feel good let's see how long they last because they're really lazy especially barbie <laughs> what's the bird so we done started our walk. Let's see how long they last. Benji, I was trying to mark something. Right. Earlier I walked him. He peed on every single tree. Every single one. Every single every one? Every single tree and pole the whole way around. He peed on it. I got both of them a new harness. Barbie got pink. Benji got blue. Oh, we got to get the... Have you seen them leash where it's, you can walk well, two of them at once? Look, see? You, he you just see did it? He, yeah. He, he don't even pee. Barbie dachshund traits have kicked in. She barks at any and everybody or anything. It could literally be nothing and she's barking. Look, there's literally nobody. Come on. Come on, Barbie. Come on, bro. Her leash say Barbie all on it. I don't know if y'all can see. I'm surprised she hasn't tried to go home. <laughs> Is it me or Benji getting lighter? Or Barbie getting darker? It's crazy. Both of our dogs is the same shade, y'all. All right, y'all. We walked for a little minute, but they're done. They went to get their little lick mat so they can like lick them out here. Benji tired. Did they freeze up yet? Well, this is probably going to take them a minute. This is good for mental stimulation. There's a lot of benefits to it. I forgot. But mainly, I know it gets them, like, tired. Barbie, y'all got the same thing. Y'all like them? Um... Benji seems to like it. Barbie, I feel like she get distracted easily. Hey y'all, so we in. Y'all, it's 8 p.m. I feel tired, like sleepy. I guess because I woke up at 8 a.m. But we about to eat, I guess, our dinner. And it's looking like I'm going to sleep early tonight because we do got gym anyways. I go to the gym Monday through Friday, so yep. I feel tired, but yesterday we um, made tacos. It's, um, I forgot the damn meat. In English, what is the damn meat type? Oh, I just want to lay down and go to sleep. About to eat tacos and watch something. I don't know, like a movie or something. Would say, let me go in the kitchen. I made ours yesterday, so they make ours today. Yeah, but. Why don't you lit off the tacos? Yeah, I'm just <clears throat> this the meat. Dang, did I put some water? 
and then they doing the tacos. You got your cilantro, limes, onion, avocado, and the salsa. All right, y'all. Here go my plate. Look real delicious. I'm about to go in. All right, y'all. I had to get a little comfy for me. My tacos, as y'all seen. We gonna watch Love is Blind. I couldn't find, um, like, a movie. So this is, like, a series. So, cheers. These hit every time. Thank you. Drinking poppy. The raspberry rose flavor. Good. Well, I started without you. Hey, do you want some of this? Karen said supposedly it make it taste better, but I don't never put none on there. Let me see, put a little bit. No, right here. I just want to take one bite. With the lime. She said it make it juicier. I don't know about juicier, but it tastes good. I don't taste the difference. It's so good. I can't even tell y'all what this meat is. I forgot, I gotta ask Karen what's this meat in English. I know what it is in Spanish. Mm -hmm. Would you do this? Choose to marry somebody but without seeing them? Marriage is insane. You gotta go right to marriage. I feel like I could do it. I feel like I gotta be attracted to you. I don't know. Somebody keep eating my tacos. I got two left. What you got? Three. And we're about to watch Love is Blind. I'll keep y'all updated on how we go. I heard it's good this season. Why my head is so big? Got a head like Natalie. <laughs> she got a big chin. That's what she got. Stuffed. Like turkeys. They're like what? You know, having Matt conversations you. about our emotions is probably not somewhere I would excel. I'm full. What about you? Ooh. I was hungry as heck, too. Oh, look, 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 look. look. Uh, he just walked out while the girl was talking. <laughs> What's wrong with this guy right here? So, we chilling watching Love is Blind still. I'm going to clip my nails tonight so I could probably go get short nails tomorrow like I told y'all. Because I got content to get done and this is just not it. Yep, we're chilling right now. Hey y'all, so it is the next day. So today we're about to head to the gym. We really don't have a specific time we go, we be going late. So it's really like no pressure whenever we wake up, we go. It's about to be 1 p.m. and we just not going. I got on this little set. I went gym shopping at Forever 21 with Tammy. And I found me a few little sets, so... I like that this one, the loose. I feel like in the loose over the fitted. We ready to curls. Yeah, I be I need to find a way to protect my curls, like to sleep in them. I don't be wrapping them or nothing. I know you're supposed to wrap them so they can be a little more fresh. They still look good, but I know you're supposed to wrap them. So we gonna probably start doing that soon. But yeah, we about to go to the gym. Then we got a few room updates. We got a new mirror. And then we gonna add frame pictures of me and Zay on top of the bed. I already ordered the frame. So we gonna get into that after the gym. Just wanted to check in with y'all. So I will see y'all once we get there. You want to tell somebody, bitch, tell them how you let me fuck. I don't want him by none of your business. Ain't no clock involved. My mind so fucked up, I see murder chilling in the park. Talk on the net, I make my fault. You go and flat as fuck. Real stuff, he got six toes, he a preacher. Watch it every day, he don't get no fuck. He to leave some. Niggas know what happened about four nine when you bleed. Fuck up in the hole, my bro, when niggas on the teeth. Killing all the rats. I'm robbing all the robbers. I'm real trap stuff from Vulture Island. All right, don't move wrong in this bitch. I've been a shot son.
what is up gang hit that subscribe <laughs> that's how them youtubers be what is up gang what is up and then they drop a fire i always hated those youtubers so i ain't doing that but we is back from the gym gym was good as y'all see we had upper day we usually do like upper what is it legs or leg day, leg day full, body. full body but we always do core at the end core and cardio so today was upper it was good but we back me and her about to make english muffins one of my favorite breakfasts quick and easy you need of course the english muffins but we get the wheat ones your turkey sausage eggs uh like cheese that's in the fridge and stuff so real simple real good all right so let's play some music while we make breakfast excuse the back i need to do dishes as y'all can see I like this song. Hey, boy. I'm gonna take a bougie ass, throw it down, and I'm gonna take a butter that she wants. Cece, Cece, I'm gonna take a butter that she wants. Tell me what she wants. Pass me the butter. Whatever she wants. So put some butter. <laughs> Whatever she wants. Oh, damn. And put your patties in there. Alright, y'all. We got our sausages in here. After this, Karen do the eggs with this love from a mason jar. I don't know how to do the eggs. She do the eggs, so. What happened to our like thing? Oh, we got two. We had a lot of mason jars. It ain't really much to it. I'm going to show y'all once. It's done, then you toast the bread in the toaster, add the cheese, and then we get done. Quick and good. All right, y'all, so it is done. So this is what it looks like. Y'all like my new little plate? It's actually like a little tea set. It comes with like this little cup, little plate. So you can either put it on there or, you know, use it for, to put something. I got Poppy in here, my little prebiotic soda that I've been hooked to. So we're about to take a bite. I usually like to put double meat, but you know, we on a diet, so we on doing one. So, cheers. It's still steam coming out of it. So, of course, after this, I need to freshen up. For the frames, Claudia, I forgot what store she told me. She told me two stores. So, we're gonna go get the frames of the pictures we just going like with black and white pictures i need to choose out the pictures of me and say we got some stuff to do in the kitchen because if you follow my spam page you seen i want to redo my kitchen and i was thinking should i keep the red kitchen or should i do neutral i don't know but a lot of y'all was saying red and then a lot of y'all was saying neutral to switch it up but i feel like everybody do the nude kitchen so that's why i like in my kitchen because it's red different but Claudia was like we could do neutral and red so we gonna switch the kitchen up. We ain't fully ordered everything, but I got like a little few stuff. So I don't know, we'll get to that as well today. You know, new kitchen stuff. That one. Right. I'm about to finish my breakfast. Once I'm freshened up, I will check it with y'all. I think I'm gonna clip these off. I ain't get to last night, but it did look crazy. All right, y'all, so we're ready for the day. As y'all see the curls, is back fresh. I just did leaf in conditioner and water. And it didn't really take much, they still look fresh. Fit of the day is this Fashion Nova set, just lounging. It's like some little knitted leggings. I like this little fold over, and then like a little cardigan. Looking type of top, chilling. I don't know what shoes I'm gonna put on yet. I went with a small, but it feels like it's just gonna keep going down as I walk. I guess I should've got an extra small cause. That's gonna be annoying. I'll probably see y'all when we're pulling up to the store to show y'all like y'all you know the pictures we decide with. I'm loving the haircut. What about y'all? All right, let's go. Hey, you all made it to Staples, but I wanted to show y'all the pictures first. So we're doing eight pictures. This is the first one. It's me and Zay anniversary day. We did like a video shoot for some people that sent us these coats. Valentine. Of course, we had the one with the kids. Benji and Barbie. Us in Miami recently. My birthday when we first met in Miami. This was Valentine's our anniversary. That was Valentine's. I think this was our anniversary pictures. I think I'm not sure. But yeah, these the eight pictures, y'all. Alright, we're at the copy and print center. 
We had an email to pictures today, so I guess we just wait. Yeah, they look good. Yep. Yep, All right, so we got quick little lunch before we head home. Um, Dario's. I got me a chicken wrap with grilled chicken jalapeno cheddar wrap with a side of sweet potato fries and ice water. What you get? This is a mukbang. Got a cherry wine, some crinkle fries, jalapeno ranch. Jalapeno ranch we got. See, when I first got this, I'm thinking it's just like flavor jalapeno ranch. But come to find out, it actually got jalapeno chunks in there. And I didn't find that out probably until like my fifth or sixth time eating it. Oh my God, dog. That's the best thing ever. That's what I usually get if I wasn't on diet. <laughs> I might want to sell some of your ranch. I want to try it since it's jalapeno wrap. I don't think this one jalapeno ranch though. Yeah, I'm just still in a little bit to try it out. All right. That's good. I don't know. I haven't mm. watched some white in a long time. I like how they buns be. I they grill it. So I'm about to finish my other little half. We're gonna go home and put these frames up. Say go put the frames up. Yeah, I don't know why you said we. <laughs> All right, y'all. All right, y'all. We're home. Zay about to bring the huge mirror in here. Then we're about to get started soon. It's heavy. <laughs> Zay's so confused on why I got this big mirror when he got home. So that's the before right there. Before. Y'all see the little gap difference. And a standing one. It was bending. I hope y'all can't see me in the back. <laughs> oh, okay. So move the other one. Yeah. Right. We got it that big to cover the arm. Um... Yeah. Need it the farthest the farthest again. Doesn't seem like that. Look at a little to the right because I can still see one of the holes. Yep, there we go. All right, y'all, up close of the mirror. As y'all see, real big, can't even get it in the frame, but definitely gave a pop in here and it's perfect because they go with these that you know we got on the side of the beads. But prepare to be sick of me. Well, my little murder picks now. So next frames. The room is coming together beautiful. Y'all seen we missing still Barbie crate. Like I told y'all, her crate is like custom, basically. Her little doggy area isn't ready yet. Y'all see her toys just be on the ground. I already got the little um toy baskets. We gonna put her toys in. So I'm ready for her crate to get here. Y'all seen the pictures. So let me show y'all the frames. We got them from Amazon, so it was like a three pack. So we got nine, I'm not sure if we're doing nine, or I think Claudia said we're doing eight, like two rows, four. These are the frames. So as y'all see, is that wood frame. So once I got up there, I had Ask Claudia, was I doing 12 by 16 or smaller for the pictures? So the pictures are actually 8 by 10. So the she wanted the frame to be bigger than, you know, the actual pictures. So, of course, first thing we're about to do is add all the pictures into the frames. 
Honestly, I'm trying to stay focused. You must think I got to be joking when I say I don't think I can wait. I just need it now. Let us through my way. I just need some deep. I just need some love. Tired of fucking with these lame niggas, baby. I just need a thug. Won't you be my plug, ayy? You could be the one, ayy. Can start with a handshake, baby. I'ma need more than a hug. Girls can't never say they want it. Girls can't never say yeah. Girls can't never say they need it. Girls can't never say nah. Girls can't never say they want it. Girls can't never say how. Girls can't never say they need it. Girls can't never say nah. I wanna be a healer. I can be real good. Please don't get any feelings. Hey, I need some love. Hey, I need some love. Hey, I need some love. Hey, and you can just. All right, y'all, we put the pictures into the frames, as y'all seen. They look good, so I'm ready to see them up. Pretty much, they got to put the nails, y'all, and all of that extra stuff. So, I'm probably just going to show y'all once he start placing them, because I know the nails and trying to get it perfect is going to be a little tricky, but we're doing two rows, four on four. So, the frames ain't on there yet. He just placed them, like they lean on top of the bed. And then he'll just put the nail a little on top of the frames. With you by my side. One down, seven to go. Uh, this one of. That top row gonna be tricky. Down ca camera. Damn. Jesus Christ. All right, so the final, I think all the nails is in. I don't even know what time we started to see how long it took. Last one. All right, y'all, now that it's all done, this is how it looks. I don't know, the light. If y'all can really see, let me get up on the bed. Yeah, the light kind of messing it up, but do y'all see like the vibes? It matched the dressers, cute, cute. With the number. So all that's kind of missing right now is the Barbie area, ugly. All right, y'all, room getting better and better. But we about to cook dinner. I really told Zay I was craving jerk wings because he makes some really good jerk wings. When we first made them, he found some recipe and then he just made them probably like 10 times after that. We just was having jerk wings back to back, back to back. I'm like, we ain't had jerk wings in a minute. So I told him to make some. And he said he wanted me to help when he the one that be doing them because I don't know what he be doing. So, yep, I'm about to be his sous chef and see what he need help with. So, let's head in the kitchen. We vibing, so y'all gonna hear music. Wings is clean. Salt. Pepper. Goya lobo. Seasoning sauce. Of course, the jerk. Alright, <laughs> right, so this is what it's looking like. 
I added oil, this chili, sweet chili sauce. I'm supposed to be sous chef and did everything. All right, child, so this is what they look like. It's 20 minutes in the oven and they flip them and then another 20 minutes. So they look good and seasoned. So they about to go in the oven. All right, child, so the wings is ready. This is what they look like. My plate, well, me and Zay plate. Ranch on the side. So let's dig in. These be spicy. It still tastes dark to me. Hot though. God damn. But y'all ain't never said goddamn. Yeah, we do. In years. I usually can only always eat like like four of my mouth be burning. Like spicy but still good. Not even in the angle. Let me taste some orange juice with me. Taste some milk. Oh, rice, knock it down some? Mm hmm <coughs> I remember that used to be spicy. You done? You only ate one. No, I didn't. I ate two. I ate a flat and a drum. I'm on four. But my lips burn. Let me see your eyes. Huh. She eating it piece by piece instead of just biting it. Yeah, she did. Things to do for me. And so quiet. <laughs> yep, my camera down blinking. Camera about to die on y'all. Tomorrow's Friday, of course, the last day in the gym. Camera about to die. Let's in the gym. Get started in the kitchen. Decor. Camera got a studio session booked. 7 to 10. So that's the moves for the nighttime. Bad family about to record a song. So that should be fun. So, yep. I will see y'all in the AM. Because the girls saying they want to go to the gym early. I was just telling y'all we ain't got no specific time. So they said they want to go a little earlier. So I need to be going to sleep earlier. So, good night. Homer hanging on my neck, the bracelet matches the set. My brother named his ting the dollar, stop all that back and forth over the neck. My mama wish I would've went corporate, she wish I would've went exact. I still turn into a CEO, so the lifestyle she respect. Hey, two sprinters to Quebec, Chevy, do it on back. They only giving niggas plus one, so I never pull up to the mat. You know I gotta bring the set. You know I gotta bring the G block. You know I gotta bring the D block, cause you know I stick in your game. Hey. You know I stick it get You know I stick it get You know I stick it get Want me to play with that cat Love how I'm making a way You know I stick it get Hey yo, Eric, bring them girls to the stage Cause somebody's getting paid And free big slime out the cage And shorty try to play it cool But now she wish she would've stayed Cause every song that I made Is ringing like I got engaged Love my guys, I wouldn't trade Run a cradle to the grave, hey Gordo got me on a wave, and got me on a wave. Couple of hits like your brain, what? You niggas better behave. All that pumping up your chest, all that talk about the best. You know how I stick it. If I'm with two of them, then it's a threesome. If she alone, you know she a freak one. If it's an escort, it's a police one. King of the hill, you know it's a sweet one. If we together, you know it's a brief one. Back in the ocean, you know it's a, it's a deep one. Forgave niggas and they feelings. Lucky for y'all, we don't do civilians. You say I changed, I say that I million. I did. The toughest actor follows back on tour. Off-road, made back. Pyrex, trap, Virgil came back through the boy. Damn. That's something, tell me niggas really had they back turned Tell me I ain't talking my sister When I say niggas down to pack something for me Then they thought they had a trap Hey y'all, we're back from the gym 
My cousin was waiting on me here because she had a surprise for me. And I'm about to show y'all because it's so cute. It's a damn basket. So let me show y'all everything. Oh my God. A damn SpongeBob bouquet. Like what? I ain't never heard something like this. I'm gonna keep it just like this in the plastic bag forever. <laughs> oh my god, y'all look. It's mis it's all of them, right? Yeah. Yeah, except for plants. That's so cute. So oh, we got some my favorite water. Told her I was healthy, so she got me healthy ice cream I've been on. One of these healthy popcorn. She got me stuff I just been needing. I needed a new one. Here we got Harris Lee, our goddaughter. What's this, like a fuzzy one, Chelly? Yeah. It look different, a beauty blender. But this the brand I use. <coughs> My mascara needed that. I'm gonna try this little lip oil. I've been wanting one. I've been wanting the, um, the Dior one. Oh. But I heard this one is like a dupe of it. Yeah, the lip oils is popular right now. It feel good. And smell good. And then we got a sugar scrub. So this is like a little surprise basket for being um her daughter's madrina, which in English is godmother. Me and Zay are gonna be the padrinos. So thank you for everything. What I think I'm gonna do is get ready for the day. Remember I told y'all that Karen booked a studio session for, you know, basically the Bad Family to record a song, all of that. So what I wanna do like a natural hairstyle, one I used to do back then. I know it's a little time consuming, so I don't know how long it's gonna take me, but it's like the little rubber band hairstyle. Like, I'm about to basically shower, um, you know, freshen up, and then we gonna head upstairs because I'm gonna do this natural hairstyle with y'all. I feel like back then I used to do so many different natural hairstyles and, you know, I used to be feeling my hair, so I just need to get back into that. So, yep, I'll see y'all once we upstairs because I'm about to freshen up. I'm all sweaty and y'all know after the gym. Hey, y'all in the closet room with it. So I'm gonna do my hair first, but I'm about to let the concealer sit on my dark marks. So I'm just putting a little primer right now. I'm excited about the studio because we really about to make a song. You know, we making a song for fun. It ain't like serious. So I feel like it's going to be fun and most of all funny because what is everybody about to say? I actually already have my verse written down. Make sure y'all go to Karen's channel back Karen. Because I most likely show y'all like, you know, doing my little verse or whatever. But on Karen's channel, it's going to be the whole thing. The everybody verses, the final song. Oh, and if it turned out good, we could probably have Zay do like a music video for us. This might be fun, y'all. I feel like this hair stuff might take a little minute. Y'all, comment some stuff for dark marks. It be the dark marks now. It don't even be like acne. I'm about to put this lip oil that my cousin gave me. I really liked how it felt. So, yep, it feel good. I have not done my natural hair like a hairstyle in a minute. So, let's see how this goes. Alright, so I think I first need to section out the part. And what makes it better is that I don't have long nails, so it should make this process a little easier. Everybody want curly hair, but little do they know. It's a little struggle. Big struggle. You make a part. Put this hair up. So when I do my own hair, I do not care about no straight lines. Kiss baby. It's gonna look good regardless. Money chill. Need a new one bad. Alright, so then with this one, you're gonna put this one in half. Yeah, this is probably gonna take a minute. I don't know what I was thinking. Probably gonna be done by the time it's time to go to the dance studio. So of course gel it. Try to like take your edges out that you want. So I'm not going to do it too tight because, alright, tie that with a rubber band. Alright, so then you'll put a little gel on the other part. But what you're going to do is then tie that first one you did into the second one. And kind of like doing it yourself, it makes it hard to do the part straight, so, yeah. Don't judge my parts, y'all. Alright, so do y'all kind of see where I'm going? So then, as the parts get bigger, of course, you're going to have more sections. So, 
Let's get it. Alright y'all, so as y'all seen, I'm done. Never again, to be honest. It's cute and all, but why does it just take me a damn hour? Definitely time consuming, and then I don't, my parts ain't straight. It's so close for us to head out for the studio. Because y'all know, remember I told y'all we were supposed to be going to the gym early? Didn't wake up till 12, so we didn't get to the gym till 1. It's already about to be down 5, because this damn hairstyle. And I still gotta do my makeup. Hair is done. I'm about to go in Karen's bathroom and freshen up the curls with leave-in conditioner and water. So this is the before. It do look cute like this big, but we're gonna refresh the curls up. So y'all should see the after in two seconds. Alright, y'all, and this is the after with the curls refreshed. They gonna dry, you know, as the time go by. Let me know if y'all would like to see more natural hairstyles on me. I used to be so obsessed with like just doing cute, different little natural hairstyles in my natural hair. But like I said, I just been lazy neglecting my natural hair. So let me know if y'all would like to see more of it. So next, I'm about to beat my face. Just something quick, natural. Here, check makeup next. I feel cute. I ain't even gonna lie. The curls is popping. All right, y'all. So makeup is done. So we're about to get dressed. I'm chilling. I'm wearing a set from Fashion Nova. I've been wanting a Ed Hardy set for the freaking longest. So I finally got one. I actually got two because that's how bad I've been wanting one. I know how to get my favorite color. So the sweater. It's just so hard. And then the sweatpants with it on the booty. I don't know what shoes I'm going to do yet or accessories. So let me go ahead and put this on and then we'll decide what we were pairing it with. All right, y'all, so it is on. It's giving, it's giving. This look good, like the pants on the booty. 
I'm gonna do these. I think I'm gonna do my furry slides. Not furry slides. What am I gonna talk about? My furry boots. The brown furry boots. I don't know. Purse, y'all. The body is giving, baby. The gym is paying off. <laughs> Look at it. This hairstyle is so cute. The hairstyle made me run late, so it's already like 30 minutes left till we have to head out. So we should be heading out soon. I will see y'all once we get there. I'm gonna add some little gold hoops, but I'm excited. Like I said, make sure y'all go to Karen's channel, but y'all know I'm gonna bring y'all along for a few. So see ya at the studio. What's my what's my rap name? I guess my rap name be Banana since it's not my real name. I guess that'll be my name. Unless I come up with something more creative on the way there. But Banana in the booth. Is y'all ready? Alright, y'all, I'm back because I wanted to show y'all the final fit together. Excuse Barbie Mess, her toys and stuff, but this is what it looking like with the boots, the brown bag shape. So. Damn. <laughs> now I really see y'all at the studio. Now now on the beat. We made it to the studio. <laughs> we make our hit to make the top mush. For lifers, it's our time. Drop the hardest nimble. <laughs> <laughs> the gang's all here. Travala. Travala, travala, travala. I'm so nervous. It's my turn. My heart is beating fast. Is it short? Oh my god, my heart is beating fast. Too short? Right there. One more time, one more time, one more time. Papi, chulo, me quiere mamá el culo. <laughs> <laughs> Bruh. Don't think too hard. You just gotta just get in your zone. Close your eyes. Papi, chulo, me quiere mamá el... What? Papi, chulo, me quiere mamá el culo. Yeah, yeah do it like that. Papi, chulo, me quiere mamá el culo. He can keep that, he can keep that. See how it sounds, see how it sounds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it sounds good. Like how? Just like that. Keep doing what you're doing, I don't know how the song made it sound. He, he can make it softer, right? No, 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 he can't make it softer. Oh. <laughs> you can just record it as many times as you need to, though. Papi. Chulo, me quiere mamá el culo. That's not real. I don't think this go with the song. It's basically talking about weed and I'm always in Pluto. It's, I need to say some freaky. Rica, 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 rica. <laughs> Just, as long as you say it good twice, he can, he can, he can loop it. Rica, 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 rica. That should be that should be good enough. That one should be good enough. Take the headphones off. Yeah, that's, that's it. 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 That
Fun, but it yeah. kind of actually sound good. We got D on the ad libs because he said he wanted yeah. to say something. I'm saying, but is it in between the pockets? Well, you might as well go in there and help him, Jay. Yeah, just tell him. Like yeah. yeah. We in here. Hey, you can really just do redo that the second part, bro. With energy, Jonah. All right, this is Karen. I did to book a studio session, and she talked about she ain't got a verse. Nobody wanna write me. No, everybody wrote their own verse. No, I am helping everybody. My, he gonna do the uh, just the lead whatever yeah. That my it's, it's it's like cutting. Say Miami is la vista, but say it clearly and like, con energy. Con energía, pero no, not too loud. Miami es la vista. La corita truena. All right, I'm gonna have to jam this in Miami. <laughs> Miami es la vista. Luego se what was the que for? My, Miami es la vista. Luego se desvista. Yeah, que luego se desvista like. It don't. I don't think I need the. Okay. Okay. So, luego que se luego se desvista. Yeah. Uh -huh. One more time. One more time. More energy. No. Luego se Energy. Keep. Come on, Jonah, you can. Chori on the beat. Like Chori. Like Chori. Me pongo bien travi. That means que haces travesura. You can do it at your pace. Fast or slow. Arreglate tu cara, me mira si te pones amargada, me amas o me odias, estoy equivocada. Oh! Let me see. Turn me up. Turn me up. Off the Hennessy, you know. She call me Poppy. Chulo. When I see my thumb in the culo. Let me go in there and say something. Hey y'all, so we made it home. It is currently two in the morning and the studio session was fun, but we were just having fun. But I think the song actually sounds a little good. I don't know, you gotta go to Karen channel to listen to it. But yeah, the song actually kind of sounds a little good. It's lit. We think we might shoot like a music video to it, but I personally had fun. When it was time to do my verse, I was a little nervous. I was a lot nervous, but it turned out good at the end of the day, so. We really wanted to do more time at the studio, but the people had like somebody else booked for the next hour, so we couldn't. So after the studio, we went to my cousin's house, Jonah and them house. But we was only there for a little minute because the only person that was left was Karen to punch in her verse. Everybody else already had did their verse. I personally feel like it sound good. It's something I would dance to and get lit to, so. I'm about to put some chill clothes and I'm about to lay down. I don't know, this day probably was short to y'all, but. It was a little long to me and we had fun, so I will see y'all tomorrow at the end of the day. Love y'all, appreciate y'all. The songs are by. So yeah, I'm lit. I'm feeling a little buzz. So.
I'm gonna see y'all tomorrow. Good night. Hey you all, so I done been ghost. It's currently Monday. Jose was going out of town where he left yesterday, so we pretty much, whenever he's about to leave, we try to spend as much time, you know. But we back, cause it's Monday and it's time to get right. And we got stuff to do. So, um, I woke up at 11.30, woke up pretty early. Yeah, I woke up early, but my gym partners ain't wake up early, so. I just been chilling in bed hoping they'll wake up anytime soon, but they didn't. So we're gonna have to get the waking up at any time together for the gym. I don't think it's gonna work. I think we need to have a set time. Even if, you know, sometimes I go through my little sleep and stuff, I just need to force myself to get up because we be going like 2 p.m. Probably be working out till like down 3.30 p.m. Get back home, eat whatever we eat in, freshen up and the day don't get started till like 5.30. Like that's already the whole day gone, so. I think it's just gonna be better for us to have a set time. I think like 10 in the morning, 11 in the morning, like just a set time. So I'm like, let me get up and get my day started. So I'm actually doing the kitchen stuff with y'all. That's what we're gonna get into. So we're doing a tea section in the kitchen. A lot of y'all probably might not know that I'm a tea girl. Like I have so many different teas. And like I've told y'all, the kitchen stuff, we, me and Claudia haven't fully decided what all, what all we're gonna get. So this is just like a start to remodel in the kitchen. And then y'all know I told y'all about the juice detox, so today I need to go grab all the stuff. So it's time we can do my juices. I need to unbox Amazon packages to show y'all like the little juice bottles and all that. Y'all, and guess what came in the mail? My passport. Y'all girl, passport is here. We gonna unbox it together, but y'all, my passport is here, I'm ready. I'm ready to go right now. My passport is finally here. They said four to six weeks. It seemed long, but it seemed like I was waiting for a minute, but it is finally here. But yeah, let's get into the well, I gotta open packages, but let's go into the kitchen and get this tea section together. All right, y'all, so everything is out the packages, and this is everything we ordered for the tea section. So we got some pumpkins, we got like a little cloud tray going on, and then this is just a little marble tray. We got the little teaspoons, we want to go to match the other stuff because. I got a glass teapot and y'all can see like the gold vibes to it. We got the little honey dipper. This is labels that's gonna go on the containers. This is like a little cup, cool little design that the spoons is gonna go into. So we got like a vase that the pumpers will be going into. And then these are the containers that like my tea bags and like the sugar is gonna go into. Let me take it out. So it looks like that with this little ball thing, I don't know. I don't know if y'all can kind of see the vibe of what this area used to look like. Let me move this stuff real quick. So, as y'all see these little red jars. They had like cereal, pasta, oatmeal, and then like my little teas. This is full of teas. So, we're basically going to be getting rid of that. And then this where the cookbook is at. I don't know if y'all can kind of see the before. It was kind of simple on this side. So, it might look a little more alive with the tea section. And these containers is the little it's the oil little bottles and as y'all see the knife set little real raggedy it was a red knife set i messed up like washing it so much dishwasher and i was trying to reorder it and that this specific one is sold out so we have to see if we're like doing red again like a red knife set or what but the other ones that's missing are like in the dishwasher so we got new of these and then we haven't found like which knife set we're gonna do and then this damn napkin dispenser y'all it stopped working probably mm, i'll say probably like six months into us using it so it was going good like when i first got it it was working and then out of nowhere it just stopped working i don't know what happened to it but it like no matter what we try to do it just stopped working so we're definitely going to be taking this off we just been letting it sit up there knowing down what it don't work to the point the napkins just got to be out looking like this all raggedy and stuff so like i said we want to redo the kitchen as y'all see we need a little upgrade but these is the new little oil containers that we're going to be doing they're so freaking cute they from target i had ordered them online and then just went to pick them up so as y'all see the o is for the oil and then for the vinegar so we'll be doing that today as well so most of the new stuff y'all see is like the nude vibes but like i told y'all i personally love the red kitchen idea so like claudia mentioned we could do red and nude together this is just some little small touches we're about to change but probably like in my next vlog or you know the future vlog we should have everything ordered and how we want to redo it but i definitely want to keep the red into it because i feel like that's me like the red kitchen is me so let me remove all the old stuff out with the old and with the new all right y'all so time to remove these 
they're still like in a little good condition so i don't think i'm gonna throw these away i'm gonna try to like see if my mom wants them or you know she knows somebody she can give them to or like one of my cousins i don't know so yeah they're not gonna go in the trash so i actually should remove all this stuff so i can wipe it down just the whole little area with some lysol wipes Alright, so it's all clean. Now we're going to get started. Alright, y'all. I had to change my robe because the Bratz one is like short. So, I felt like my booty was going to pop out in time. So, I washed my containers. I'm going to put the labels on them first. I just ordered like a little pack that had like a whole bunch of different labels. So, I'm most likely keep this in case you're not going to need like a little label or something. Looks like this. Let me find the ones we need. So, the first one is sugar. Oh lord, I kind of want to do it like towards the bottom a little bit. Uh, I hate doing labels. All right, y'all. So the sugar one on there. Y'all see the little top part? I can. That's the best I can do. So, I think from afar it ain't bad. I don't know if it's because it's round. It just won't like go flat on there. Like it keep having like I think it's called like little air bubbles. So, next is tea bags. So. Gotta try to make the match up the best I can. That kind of went on there, right? Alright, y'all. I can't seem to get that top part. Looks the same as the other one. It's kind of getting on my nerves, but whatever. It's just gonna have to do. Next, we got brown sugar, last one, before we start filling them up. Oh, this is so annoying. No exaggeration, I literally spent 30 minutes on these labels to try to get the little bubbles out and nothing is working. So, we're just going to move on, to be honest. It's not going to be the end of the world. I got a little different teas, but I'm going to go with this detox one since y'all know I'm going to do my detox soon. So, let's go ahead and put them in there, tea bags. Hopefully, they all fit. Try to put them a little neat. So that's what that looks like. All right, y'all. So next, sugar, but sugar. All right, brown sugar. I went with this light one. All right, this one messy. Alright, so that one was a little messy, but that'll do. Let me clean this up. Alright, y'all, so I really don't know where I'm supposed to put it at, so I'm gonna work with this corner. Then I'll see if I have to move it around. So I think, like, that right there, the tray, this heavy. Can you even see? Let me move, y'all. So then we'll put this stuff on there, so. Sugar. Should I do tea bags first? Then the sugars. Okay, so the containers fit perfect under y'all. Alright, keep moving y'all because it's like real close. So this little cloud tray. So this is actually gonna be for my lemon. I'm just gonna have two lemons on there, like a little tray. I honestly just felt like the lemons was gonna look cute, so maybe I should've got three. All right, so next was the little honey jar. It comes with two of these. So I'll just have like one in the drawer, I guess just an extra one. So we got our honey, let's go ahead and fill this up. Thirty years. Like to just let that sit right there. And then I have this little half left, so we're gonna put that in there too. So over here by the base we're gonna put our little teapot. It's like this. It's kinda like the little neutral vibes to it. So 
I'm thinking like right there. I'm gonna also put the spoons over here by the teapot just cause like the gold on gold. It's kind of taking a minute, but we got the little pompous we're going to add to the base over here. So they're not really staying tall. Oh, there you go. I got this base from at home. Everything else I think was from Amazon. Alright, yeah, this honey kind of taking a little minute, so we're just going to have to do it like that. So, spoon, whatever. I think this over here is well. I don't know. Alright, so this is a better overview of what it's given. It's kind of like in this corner because I really don't know if she was going to like try to add like something red to this corner. So, you know, we can still keep the neutral and red going on. I'm about to call Claudia and I'll see if I need to move everything or anything around because I don't know. She might want to move some stuff around, but this is the vibe so far. All right, y'all, y'all know my girl don't never answer, so we're gonna wait for her to call back, but for right now, we're about to do these. So we got our vinegar, and we got our olive oil. Let's fill them up first. I wonder if I need a funnel, cause I'm clumsy. Let me just take my time with it. So I always thought that um, the little glass, I mean the little oil bottles, I always thought they only come in like glass, like the see-through ones. So when I see these, I feel a little all done. Oil. I'm personally just gonna put it right there until Cloudy colors back. So the vinegar we never had a container for it. We just always just store it in a pantry. But we use the vinegar a lot when we like cooking, you know, to clean up our meats. So I was like, yeah, we need a bottle for it. All right, y'all. So. Vinegar. This little area is looking cute. We don't know. We're going to add a little red vibe to it. And I'm just putting this right here. I don't know. So whenever Claudia let me know. And if she do change it around, I will show y'all. But as of right now, I'm about to freshen up. Because like I told y'all, we got to go get the stuff for the juice detox. And then Tammy also wants to take the dogs to the mall. They're doing like um Easter shoot with the bunny. Like the dogs on Mondays is for the dogs. So we're going to take Barbie benji tiny all of them and tammy got barbie a damn uh, easter dress she got a little easter bandana for the boys yeah i'm about to freshen up i think today's gonna be hair wash day so for right now i might just put it like in a pony i don't know what i'm about to throw on but something quick because tammy did say she was on the way so I'm about to do a little one two one two and i will check in with y'all hey y'all so i'm dressed i tried to throw like a little easter color on so i got this pink little tennis skirt set Cause we're not going back to play tennis and then it's like the little zipper coat. It's sunny out, but it's still like a little chilly. So I should be good with the sunny slash chilly. And I'm wearing my Gucci bag cause I'm wearing these little Gucci slides with the little flowers. I think I'm giving a little spring Easter vibes. So I did put the little hair in the pony cause I told you it's hair wash day. So I didn't want to do too much. So we ready. Tell me. Got here while I was getting ready, so she been waiting on me. So, yeah, I need to come on. I just gotta put Barbie Love's Easter dress on, and we should be heading out. I might wear this like this. Yeah, cause I don't feel like holding it, so I'm ready to do that. Let me get all Barbie stuff together, like put her harness on, her leash, and her dress. And I'll probably show y'all before we head out, or when we in the car, or when we pulling up. Cause I said Tammy been waiting on me, so I need to hurry up. All right, y'all. This is Barbie dress, and she ready to get off. All right, man. We trying to show them your dress. Extra cute with the little bunnies. Where's Benji? Over there. Tiny. Barbie. He got his little bandana on. The <laughs> doves. Let's go. Let's go. Here go Barbie. Where are you going? We made it to the mall. Tiny and Benji all the way over there. Let's see how they do. 
our Easter Bunny photos. We made it. Just the vibes. Cute. So Tammy going first. What's well, Tazana and Tiny? Oh, the bunny here already. I think Barbie's scared of the bunny. Barbie, it's gonna be okay. Look at Benji. Barbie trying to leave. I don't think she wants to take the picture. No, oh, they got um, Tazana. Nana's going next with Barbie. <laughs> You're not gonna take her harness off? Barbie. 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 Can, call her name Barbie. <laughs> all right, child. So we're all done. And this is what me and Barbie looking like. Oh, you see the 2024 with the little yeah. bunny? So Barbie was, wasn't was trying to look. So this was the best one. So our pictures is done. She did all right, I'll say. Not too good, not too bad. All right, child. So we've dropped the dogs off because we came to the grocery store. So remember I told you about my juice detox. So we came to the grocery store with Timmy. And when I dropped the dogs off, I grabbed the bottles. So let me show y'all. I ordered these off Amazon. They're like glass bottles. This is what she'll be using to put my juices in. Real cute. And I got glass. So just, you know, if I want to do this in the future, I could just always keep these or whatever. So real cute, real cute. I already made my list. Right here, we got my list of all the stuff we need. Yeah, we came to Publix. And I think after this, we're going to grab lunch at Firebirds. I think. So I'm walking in and I'll see y'all once we get in there and we're grabbing everything we need. What have you become? What have you become? What have I not? That's what you've been. I was blind. I was in it. I was bad. Oh, I, I thought that I was changing you. I can't believe I faced you. You know your mama ain't faced you like that. Look at your behavior. And that's what she is ashamed of your damn. Look at what you become. Matter of fact, what you've been. I was jealous, man. I was just so in it. I was just so committed. No, I don't regret it. But I know what love is once bad. Let it go, let it go, let it go. We came to Firebird to grab some food. Mama Straight has joined also. We got some pineapple mocktails and a deal. This look good, though. I'm about to try it. It's good. Yeah. It's like a little on the sour side. Yeah. It's good. I give it a. This been my favorite thing recently. I can eat this every day. Caesar salmon, same thing. My mom got a salad for I don't know what reason. Uh, they go Tammy's and Tazana's. Pasta. Okay, cool. I got you. What Tazana get? Just mac and cheese. Oh. I had the wings, it was good, but then I tried to order them for take and it wasn't good. 
I think that's the one you got when we did our smoothie diets. Yeah. Or did I get it with you? No, because no, I don't. Yeah. Yeah, I like this salad. Right yeah, I like this salad right here. Yeah, I can eat it every day. Since we help you. I'll be still out there in Croton. Why? Why? Did your braces? You remember that's what broke my uh, braces the other time? Oh, yeah. 10 out of 10. Hey, y'all. So we're back home. I just gave Barbie her dinner. It's like 7 30 p.m. I'm about to go through a little few packages. Barbie got her Bark Fox. I'm trying to go to sleep early tonight because I want to get into the routine of going to the gym early. All right, so y'all already know Barbie does her little Bark Boxes. So for this month, Bow Wow by you. It's March, isn't that Easter? What? I'm so confused about this theme. They could have kept it, to be honest. And more treats. I'm so disappointed in this month. I really don't get it. It usually goes with whatever the holiday is. It's really, it usually be cute little themes. I don't. I don't even know what that is, to be honest. All right. Dog kill. Y'all, I seen this damn Betty beep. Like little lounge PJ said, and I just had to have it. It's the long sleeve little tee and little hearts, roses. It's the little tee and then like the little um shorts. I went with a size medium, so tell me that's not so cute. From Body by Raven. It was actually supposed to be two packages, but I guess only one has got here so far. So let's go ahead and open it. I had shot from her sale and then I had shot from her new basics. Okay, so this is the this is the swimsuit. I've been wanting this and she had it like a sale and had like old pieces in it. These like the little bottoms. I went with a small, real cute. I've been wanting this for a minute. I'm just trying to like show it fast because like I said. So the top I did go with a large because yep. I just wanted to be sure it was gonna fit. So I don't know if y'all can really see the vibes of it, but as y'all see, like the little right there, large, it looked like it's gonna fit good. So that's from body. The last thing, which I think it is. Finally got a passport. Eh, 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 eh. We gotta turn up on a passport. We gotta turn up on a passport. Turn up on a passport. Turn up. Ah, 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 
All right, y'all. So as y'all see, we're all done trying Beyonce hairline and hey, baby the curls is popping. If you want to see like in detail, like the review, the hair review we did, make sure y'all go to Karen's channel. For y'all, just showed y'all like you know a little montage going on. But in Karen, we really got into detail about how we liked the products. Yeah, y'all. But that took us three hours. We had started like nine or like nine about to be ten but it is 145 so it literally took us three hours that's why sometimes i'll be trying to do this i'll be trying to deal with my hair because it just takes too long especially when you're doing like a mass deep conditioner all of that it take forever yeah it took a minute but i say it's worth it but it's 146 and y'all know we is supposed to be going to the gym early but i feel like no matter if i'm feeling tired we're still gonna wake up because we need to get on this routine even though it's 146 i still feel regular so i am still gonna take the um let me sleep because i'm not about to risk it and be up like till damn five or something just look like little purple gummies tastes good I guess I could tell y'all if it like knocked me out real quick, if I was sleep through the whole night and how did I feel waking up. We about to see how long this take, go to sleep, cause tomorrow we got the gym. Y'all see we didn't go today, so I'm ready to get back to it tomorrow morning. So good night y'all, see y'all when we wake up. Good morning you all, so we woke up. I didn't get up till like 9.45 and got ready for the gym. It's currently about to be 10. Our gym doesn't open until 10.15. So we head out like 10.15. So I got this little sip from Forever 21. So today I actually start my juice diet. Tammy made them like I told y'all. My mom is actually going to start joining us at the gym. So she said she's going to meet us there. And if you don't know, Tammy and my mom are neighbors. So I just told Tammy to give my mom all the juices. So I'll grab them at the gym. I don't have the juices with me yet. But I'll start taking my first one at the gym. So it's actually four juices a day. So my juice detox is going to be for three days. So let's see how this goes. Really just to clean up the body. I know you probably lose like a few pounds. Nothing crazy. You might lose up to like three to five. But I'm working out with mine. So I don't know if I'll lose like more. But I don't know. When me and Tammy did the smoothie diet, the 10 days. No, we did two weeks. Was a little hard, but it was worth it. I might do like little snacks like fruits and stuff. But no food. Three days. So... I hope I can do this. Yeah, we're up early. We're about to head to the gym. Just wanted to update y'all that today we start the juice detox, so I'm excited. Oh, the melatonin knocked me out in 30 minutes. Like before I could even think, knocked out. I slept through the whole night. Like I didn't wake up till my alarm went off. If y'all got sleeping problems, try it out. It's called the Lemmy Sleep. So let's head to the gym. All right, y'all. Mama Estrella's here, and Tammy packaged them up like this for me. I think I'm gonna start with the carrot one. I'm gonna show y'all better luck when we get home. But yeah, we about to go in the gym. I just want to show y'all that I'm about to grab my first juice. All right, we about to try this first one. It's an orange carrots. I like them. I forgot what else. Oh, it's good. It's good. And with the juice detox, you gotta drink a lot of water as well. I might actually go buy some more water. But we're currently signing my mama up to our membership. So like, let me go ahead and try this juice for y'all. But it's good, shout out to Tammy. But I'm about to go ahead and start my warm up. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
y'all back from the gym, so we're about to unload all our juices into the fridge. As y'all see, I try to show y'all the look of them. But the carrot one, y'all see me drink. The green one. The mango one. She said this one was like a little thicker or sour, I think she said. And then the watermelon one. So we're about to load these up in the fridge. One down. Sadly, it will be no breakfast for me. Set them out. I want like a little picture of them. Then I'm gonna make room in the fridge. Them. Oh, I never ended up updating y'all on this little T section. This is how she wanted me to move it around because she felt like that stuff was blocking the teapot. So, this is how it ended up staying. There we go. Let me get a little picture real quick. so all my juices is in the fridge stocked up so that's what they look like all organized so usually after the gym i'll you know take barbie handle her feed her take her out the potty all of that so that's what i'm about to do probably after that we'll shower and freshen up and all that Alright y'all, so as y'all seen, Barbie is handled. I like to play with her when I get back. Just like 30 minutes to an hour to tire her out so then I can do what I need to do. This might be like the first realistic day y'all see in my life where I'm not like out, turn it up. Or like just not doing nothing. Y'all know usually we're doing something around the house. Today I have no plans but to edit. About the, I got this Amazon package like a little towel like robe and for the hair but yeah y'all if i'm not editing i'll most likely just be watching tv all day playing with barbie like my days just really consist consists of like going to the gym figuring out what we're gonna eat if we gonna cook or eat out being with barbie just watching shows like i love watching binge watching shows like i love a show that got 200 episodes i would sit there and watch them all day long yeah today we got a little something to do which is editing but the days where i ain't got nothing to do baby we is in bed and then i don't gotta worry about eating so y'all so i'm really about to be chilling all day because as y'all see the juices is already ready so i just wanted to let y'all know today is gonna be a real realistic chill day in my life
this fresh and up y'all all right y'all we out the shower i love when it ain't here wash day so i just got in a pony we need the towel this time but i already like this so far like you ain't gotta worry about it falling got like a little pocket so yeah i'm order more colors in this um about to do my skincare i like listening to music when i'm doing my skincare nikki concert is six days away y'all so i literally just been playing nikki 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 that's it so let's do our skin care <laughs> just like I'm, I do get a pimple I get dark marks every now and then so I did my little research and I'm trying out two new products I've probably been using them for a week so far I had like two dark marks up here I got one right here and my chin area is always the one that just got all these dark marks or like that's where I would get pimples at and maybe around the cheeks right now I just got one but it's literally always the chin and I'm like I don't really get breakouts as much, but these dark marks need to go. So I got this from the Hero brand. This one is a lightning wand, so it's a dark spot brightening serum. That's what it looks like. And then I got the Rescue Balm from them. This is the Post Blemish Recovery Cream. So you put this one after a pimple. So let's say you get a pimple and i put the pimple patch suck all that nasty stuff out of it and then i'll apply this one like every day so i don't got no active or like any pimples everything that y'all see is dark marks so we won't be using this one today we'll only be using the lightning one you kind of just press it right here and it takes out the product it's like a little yellow and you just roll it under and say do it like twice a day so i try to do it like you know in the daytime and then again at nighttime i feel like i haven't really seen much difference on the chin area but like i told you i had some up here and it left and by my eyebrow it got lighter with these chin ones need to come on but it do say you gotta be like consistent twice a day so i've been trying to be consistent so hopefully we see a difference with that soon and i had ordered me some little brightening eye masks i know tammy uses these and she said she really liked them and then i've just been seeing them all over the internet so i wanted to try them we got to try them for the first time i think that people say it can go either way you want it to go so if you want the smaller part or the bigger part i think i'm gonna do the smaller part and i feel like they're so cute so 
It says fade the look while deep puffing your under eyes. Apply to under eye for 15 minutes. Use two to three times a week. Good. Yeah, I'm like, why not? Cause we about to be chilling in the house. Well, y'all can't even see the picture with the glasses, but. And we're about to put some of this lip balm on. I don't know if I ever showed y'all this, but um, Karen had bought it for me. It's from Sephora. It's almost gone. So I definitely recommend and like the little stain on it is catchy. <laughs> so I like it. That's pretty much it for the skin stuff. Since my hair is freshly washed, all I'll do is like, let's say I was going somewhere. I'll like put water on it, retouch the curls. But they look pretty good and I'm not going nowhere. So... I don't know, I might put a little water on these front pieces. It's always my front pieces. I'll like put conditioner and refresh them. But what I'm going to use is Beyonce Sac Sacred. Sacred, if I'm pronouncing it right. The Cine Lotion. So I'm just going to get a little bit and retouch my hair. Literally just a little bit because my hair already has this in it. This is just like to retouch it with a little water. And I'll just go like this. Not too rough. Get that frizzy hair and curls. It smells so good, y'all. Alright, y'all. So hair, like I said, we ain't have to do much to it. Just refreshing it up. Body I wear. I use cocoa butter. Let me put my deodorant on real quick. Put my deodorant on. So I really don't use a specific deodorant. I really don't even know if this is a brand you can buy somewhere. This is the deodorant we used when we was younger. My mama buys it from I don't know who. She stopped getting it for a minute. So I had just started getting like the, but she recently like gave us about 15 of these. So this is the one we use. And then I just put cocoa butter all over my body. I smell like cocoa butter and Chanel. <laughs> If that makes sense, but I love anything like cocoa butter. I don't need I didn't even grab no clothes to lay down in. Like chilling clothes, chilling in the house. I might lay in this little towel to be honest. Feel comfortable. Alright, my body is moisturized. And even though I ain't got no clothes on, I still put perfume on my body. That's not the one I wanted. I think I took it upstairs. Zay bought me a new Chanel. Let me go grab it. I think I took it to my closet room. All right, y'all, I'm back. So this is the new one Zay bought me. I've been wanting like a new one. <laughs> Besides the one from Miami, he got me a new one. It's like a little pink tint to it. I don't know if you can tell, and it's round. All my other ones are square. So yeah, this one smells so good. But yeah, I, like I put perfume on every day, even after the shower, like if I'm about to just chill in bed. If I'm about to go to sleep, like, I don't care. I'll just do like this and then like put it to my neck. Oh, that smells so good. So, yeah, that's what I do even if like... Because they say perfume is supposed to go on your body, not your clothes. But I do both, like if I am going out. And my eyebrows look crazy because I don't start getting ready for Nikki until... I think I start the 23rd, like three days before. Her concert, nails, hair. I actually need to check if my outfit got delivered and see if everything fits. But yeah, I'll put like a little eyebrow gel on there because the eyebrows look crazy until we get them done. So, was that like a little after the shower routine? I don't know. But smelling good. Smelling like cocoa butter and chenille. Y'all, yeah, why well, I feel hungry? Like, I'm gonna eat some food. So, let's go get our damn next juice because y'all girl hungry. Like I told you, I'm about to chill in this. Cause this is comfy and I'm about to be in bed. Um, and when I got out the shower, I just dried myself with another towel. So this one is not wet. So yeah, let's go get my other juice. Cause y'all girl is feeling hungry now. All right, y'all, I'm in the kitchen. I'm gonna go with the green one. I personally like like green juices, drinks, green smoothies and stuff. So I want me a damn. At least a sad little some cheeks and stay on the sun right now. Stay strong. We only got three days. I 
Oh, this one's sour. I forgot what was the ingredients in each. That one has green apples, celery, lemon, ginger, and water. It's good, but it's real sour. The first one I drank had carrots, orange, pineapple, ginger, and turmeric. So, the first one I had was a 10. I give this one a 7 just because it's sour. I need some little sweetness. But, let's go ahead. We got to finish this one. And let me grab a water bottle as well. But we're about to go in the room and start editing. Hey, y'all. So, we is in bed. It's currently about to be 2.30. We got back from the gym like 12.30. So, just... Handling Barbie, me pressing them, all that just took like two hours. But my project for my um, video is already ready. Um, I had did it last night. Like just put everything on here from the camera, so today I could just start cutting. Like I was telling you, I really need to finish this vlog before we head to um, the concert. Cause we'll actually be staying in Charlotte like a few days. We're gonna have like a little staycation, a little double date vacation. Cause Kayla will be coming in town, and Zay has never met Kayla. Anytime she's came around the family or all that stuff, Zay is never there, so he has never met her. So we was like, let's do a little double date vacation, staycation in Charlotte. So after the concert, we'll still be staying there and you know hanging out, so they can get to meet each other. And yeah, so I'll probably be in Charlotte for like four days after the concert so i need to have this done and post it before i go to nikki concert because i'll be starting a new vlog for nikki concerts look at my first day my first day is an hour and 21 i actually had cut a little bit last night so it was really had said like an hour and 40 just for my first day but i gotta cut all this up So yeah, they be like, what is, what's JT, what you really do? No, no, what you really do? I be at home editing these vlogs for you. <laughs> I cannot freestyle. stuff. No, no, what you really do? I be at home editing or watching damn movies. I want to at least cut up most of the days by the end of the night, if not all. So we're about to edit, drink our juice. Because we is trying to be done, baby. All right, y'all, little update, probably like an hour in. And I finished my second one. And I also finished my water. So, yep, still cutting. First day of me editing is pretty much going to be cutting and cutting. But I don't know if y'all can see, like, all them gaps. Like, that's everything I done cut up. So, I done cut a whole bunch of stuff. But we still got more to go. But just wanted to update y'all. Hey, I'm about to put some clothes on because it's time to be Barbie. I don't know how many hours it's been since I last talked to y'all, but... I'm done cutting my first day. It's down to 33 minutes. So, hour and 40 down to 33 minutes. But, day one is done. 
Sophie Barbie. Probably chill with her for a bit. And I might start drinking my next juice. Let me take these off. They said 15 minutes. I kept them on for longer. They wasn't uncomfortable like how some usually be. Y'all seen pretty much Barbie food just later on in the day. You don't add the supplements. You add the supplements once a day. I'll probably make her like a little pup cup, like a little treat for her. But let me get up because I've just been editing, editing, editing. But day one is done. So Barbie has ate and went to potty. So I'm about to make her pup cup. <laughs> little treat sometime. Okay, I believe I get the Let's go in the room. So since she did good with her eating and using the bathroom, I got her little treat. As y'all see, she cannot wait. Ain't this the cutest thing ever? But I'm always doing something when it comes to these damn dogs. She loves her a pup cup. Come on, get down. So when she finish her pup cup, we're probably about to play and chill. I just put through this little onesie on. I'll probably drink my other juice in a little minute. I don't really feel like hungry right now, so that should be good. It's down cold and windy outside, and I want to throw on a onesie. This weather by polar, like, is it spring or is it winter? I don't get it. All done. So, we're going to do some little training before we start playing. So, Crate, she learned that one when she was a baby. But, like, recently when I've been telling her, she's just been, like, looking at me like she'll take a minute. And I need her to do it faster. So, I don't know. It's because after a minute, we stopped doing the Crate because... I don't know really just be like crate, but I want her to know it just just cuz like yeah So what I'll do is crate point and then get her a treat once she get in there I like to keep treats in the room for these type of you know little training I'm ready for her new crate to get here cuz this ain't it crate Yes I Flip your ear Sit, crate. You too excited, you don't even know what you're doing. <laughs> yes. Come here. Sit, down, crate. <laughs> yes, crate, you too excited. Crate. Yes. Come here, sit, crate. Yes. So with some of my training, I like to do little hand signals cause that's what like dogs understand more. So like certain stuff like hands and the word, like this one, down. Like when we was practicing down, I think I told y'all she just wouldn't go down whenever I said down until I started doing the hand signal, she got it. So now she'll do it without me doing the hand hand signals. I guess it like the hand stuff be a little better too. Crate. Yes. So since she doesn't have it like down packed, I'm not gonna try the crate until like just the word crate until she has it down packed. Like I think the point in this will helps her. So the next step would be like without me having a point. So yeah, we're pretty much just about to do this for, they say do it for 10 to 15 minutes because you don't want to like overdo it. When you do training, you want to do little segments a day. Hey y'all, so now I'm in bed. Barbie's still out chilling. Yeah, she's not tired yet. So we got our next juice, which is the mango one. I wanted to leave my watermelon one for last because watermelon is my favorite. So we got our water bottle too. So I want to like finish a water bottle as I finish one juice so I can keep track of my like water intake so let's try this mango one i really like mango as well i'm gonna take a little break on editing like probably just watch like one little episode of my novella since that's what i've just been doing for hours let's try this one and if y'all want i'll link like all the ingredients that i use for each juice in the description box in case any of y'all want to you know make them or try this three-day detox 
This one has just half a pineapple, two mangoes, and one lime. Oh, this one real good. I love like the mango smoothie from McDonald's. So it's kind of like that, but is it mango pineapple from McDonald's? I'm not sure, but so I just hope my watermelon one satisfied me for my last one of the day. So I'm about to watch a little episode of my novella. Let me drink my water. Like I told y'all, realistic day in my life when we ain't got nothing going on. Just chilling, me, my dog, and Zay out of town. So I really just be here whenever it's like chill days. It's just be me and Barbie. I'll keep y'all updated. I'll edit it in our last juice. I don't know. I don't want to bore y'all with too much of just talking, talking. So I'll update y'all. Juice update. Barbie move. Leave it. Cause she wants to join my juice diet. My girl. Watching my novella. Keep eyeing my down juices. You ain't getting on. Hey, y'all forgot what time it was when I last talked to y'all, but it's probably been like three hours and I already gave Barbie her last dinner. She already done went potty. It's time for my um dinner. <laughs> this is my dinner. I'm feeling a little hungry now that it's like nighttime and I'm gonna try to go to sleep early tonight, like 10, 11, cause I'm not trying to be up all night starving. I feel like if I go to sleep, it's gonna be easier for me. I pop the melatonin and I'm gonna be good. Let's try the watermelon, it's my favorite fruit. So I just hope it does it for me, man. Oh my God, this one is so good. Like perfect. Oh. Big shout out to Tammy cause she the one that made all these for me. So big, big shout out to her. And I wanted a little snack, like I don't know. I just need something to chew on. So we got a little orange. I never knew how to peel it. I always start with a bite. I don't know if that's weird to be honest. Good thing I don't got no nails right now, but yeah, that's how I start peeling mine, biting it. And we also got um another water bottle. I've been doing good with drinking the juice and then the water as well. I actually ended up cutting a whole nother day. Y'all seen, I've just been editing all day. For right now, while I'm eating my little snack and drinking my little juice, I am about to play my novella. I'm almost done with it, so I kind of want to finish it. So, little juice detox day one, since we kind of like we on the last juice i'll say so far day one has been pretty smooth i didn't really struggle with like craving much or feeling like oh yeah i can't do this i did feel hungry but then when i drank that i was good so i hope day two and day three go smooth as well these hitting the spot right now i like having chill days at home and just relaxing because i know next week is about to be real busy getting ready for nikki and going to charlotte so i need to enjoy all this relaxing and chilling while i can because next week about to be crazy and i hope one of the best moments of my life because i'm about to meet my favorite artist like i'm ready hey y'all so it's 10 30 p.m me and barbie and bed leave it all in my face excuse you So I should be asleep by 11 p.m. I still got a little bit on my juice. I'm going to chug that though. I was so into my shirt I done damn forgot. Day one completed. So I really don't know if I'm gonna bring y'all along for the full day two, day three. I might do like little quick recaps for y'all cause I'm gonna be the same thing, just drinking juice, editing. Cause I don't have no plans tomorrow. Um, I do have plans Friday. My aunt invited us to a party. I do want to let y'all know how it go though. So I am gonna let y'all know like how 
the whole thing went. Like, even if I don't update y'all for day two, I'm definitely going to update y'all for the end of day three. Just basically don't want um the three days of my detox to be repetitive. So, so we'll see. But day one is completed. I just took my melatonin. So I should be asleep soon. We got gym. You gotta know how all that goes, so good night. But it's still not bad because, like I said, I will keep y'all updated on how day two and day three went. So, wish me luck, y'all. Wish me luck. Hey, y'all. So, I'm back with the detox update. I feel how I look rough. So, the last time y'all seen me was day one of the detox. Day two, y'all, I woke up feeling not good. Like, I felt like I was getting like a little fever. I just kind of felt like a little weak. I didn't feel like myself so we woke up you know early for the gym I still pushed myself to go to the gym so we go to the gym and I'm still trying to work out but probably towards the end of it I just couldn't do it like I just kind of felt weak and I just didn't know what was going on I came home and I just felt drained and it just got worse through the day the fever got really high was coughing a little bit not really bad like every now and then and I could feel my throat about to get sore so I was just confused like why am I getting sick I tell you all the time, I really don't get sick. Like, I'm the type of people that get sick once or twice a year. The only thing I can think of is the weather change because, like, it's been crazy. It's been hot and then it's freezing cold, real sunny, then the next day it's raining. So that's the only thing I could think of, but, like, I just don't really get sick. So the only thing I could think of is the weather change. So day two of my detox, I still was, I still took all my juices even though I wasn't feeling the best. Day three, woke up feeling even worse. <laughs> Fever was just high throat got worse coughing feeling weak couldn't do nothing um day three i couldn't really do all four of the juices just because like y'all i was out of it so i took only two juices day three overall of my detox i would say it was rough because i was sick not because like you know the detox i can't say like oh i felt good or it made me feel like this or it did this because i i was sick like I've been going through it since the last time I talked to y'all. I did lose six pounds, so I guess that's the only good thing about it. But so yeah, I just been going through it since the last time I talked to y'all to right now. Like it's probably been a week since I've talked to y'all, and I just been sick. Like right now, I'm just not feeling a little better. So I haven't ate food since the last time I talked to y'all. I haven't ate food in like six days because my throat hurt. I can't eat nothing. I've just been taking Tylenol. I've been just staying hydrated with water but i haven't ate no food it's like the damn detox that went longer than the three days because i'm sick so yeah i haven't had real food y'all and it has just backtracked me with editing i haven't been able to edit y'all know i wanted to get this vlog out before nikki concert nikki concert is literally in two days and i'm not feeling my best and it has just i don't know this sickness has just kind of ruined everything like I'm so behind on editing. <coughs> oh, I haven't been able to open my packages, try it on. I forced myself to get my nails done. My nail appointment was yesterday. I forced myself to get up. I felt so weak, but I'm like, like I can't get my nails done. I have to get my nails done for this concert. So I forced myself to get my nails done. And I've just been laying here feeling down. Like why, why right now? Tomorrow is my hair appointment. I still have to force myself to get up. Like, I can't even be sick in peace because I still have stuff to do, stuff to get done. I don't know why I feel like I'm about to get emotional, but it just be like, no matter how hard life seems like it's going, things get thrown at you. It's like, none of that matter. Like, life still keeps going. You still have to get this stuff done. There's no time to relax. There's no time to chill. Like I said, I feel like I can't even be sick in peace. It's just so much on my plate that I have to get done. Maybe I'm being hard on myself because at the end of the day, it's not my fault that I'm sick. But it's just really, really, really annoying. Like, why right now? That's the annoying part. And like, I literally never get sick, y'all. Like, never. So I'm just really feeling so upset right now. But like I said, it ain't no time to be down none of that i hope i feel better soon just want to thank god for allowing me to get better because i literally been going through it for the last few days i love y'all appreciate y'all i try my damn hardest to try to get this damn vlog out for y'all sooner but you know life just be life and sometimes i just wanted to update y'all i probably just talked y'all head off but yeah i just been going through it y'all so this is the end sorry it's 
all over the place, but I just had to fill y'all in. Um, of course, I will be starting a new vlog in a few days for Nikki concert. Well, I already started it with my nails, so y'all should be seeing that soon. And I'm super excited, even though I don't look like it, but y'all know how I feel about Nikki and like how much I love her music. I'm super excited. I cannot wait. Send me some good vibes because I need it, y'all. But yeah, love y'all. And I will see y'all in my next video really, really soon. Bye. Let's go. Got the kind of vibe you never let go. She know what to do to make a man go. Up and down, up and down, up and down. Girl, let's